Hello, welcome to Maximity's next Two Minute Tuesday. My name is Bronya, and why isn't your data in tables? In Excel, I have a range of data, including department numbers, employee numbers, first and last names, and so on. If I want to add a new person to this list, I would just write the details out in each cell, copy the formulas down manually, and then I've added a new person. But then what if I want to sort the list into alphabetical order just for a moment? Or what if I want to quickly see who has the most sales? Or if I only want to see staff from one particular department? Of course you can use the sort function or the filter function and copying formulas is straightforward. Or you could not. And just make your data into a table. Highlight a selection of your data and either go to insert and then table or hold down control and tap T. A pop-up will appear allowing you to confirm the range of the table and a checkbox to select if you've included headers in your selection. If you haven't, Excel will create headers for you to edit. Click OK and you'll see your data turn into a table. A temporary ribbon appears at the top called Table Design. On the left side there's a box to input a name for your table. I'm going to write Staff Table and then press Enter. Make sure that your chosen name doesn't include any spaces or punctuation. In table style options, you can choose to remove the header row, add a total row, band the columns or rows, bold either the first or last column, or toggle the filter button. On the right side above table styles are colour and layout options. Hover over each of these to preview. Now if I want to sort by last name, I just click the down arrow in the column header and select sort A to Z. If I just want to see one department, I can select the drop down on the column header and select which department I want to see. If I want to add a new member of staff, I click on the next empty cell below department number and once I've entered data into that cell, all formatting and formulas are immediately copied down and the table has been extended automatically.